Uh, I make this zebra t-shirt. There's this um, zebra piece I drew um, last week. It's kind of fun. And I'm going to put on a t-shirt and it says something like, um, what should it say? Say, uh, right here. Say, I love Oops. No. Love. Oops. Zebras. Z. Bra. 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 I love zebras. Do you love zebras? Do you love zebras? Do you love zebras? Okay. And so we take this type, I'm gonna fix this graphic in a second. So we'll take the type, let's position it a little bit better. So. that puppy there and then I love zebras I mean I, they're okay <laughs> okay so we'll take this over here so then we'll take go to, yeah, select that and I like to uh, simplify it kind of like cleans the edges a little Which actually reduces the number of line of points, so it smooths everything out. This, take that, and then I take these two points. Hit the command J. Uh, sorry. Okay. Oops. Oh, I selected one, two, then like that, and then these right here. So we take this and then I love that. It's kind of cool. Sometimes. Okay. And then like that. And then we're gonna sell it on the Amazons. All right. Sell it on okay, so now we have um, this. And then uh, this is the raw that I just copied and pasted from my camera. I just took a picture of it from my original drawing. And then we're going to go to image trace, go to image trace, and hit turn it to a uh, vector, which is my favorite thing to do. Now look at that. beautiful, beautiful. I love that. And then we, if we go high, that it kind of like puts more different, uh, more uh, points on there. You could smooth it out as well, to, sort of like we just did. If you brought this to low, it's going to smooth it out even more. Let's see, which is interesting. I love that you kind of create these new looks uh, that you didn't imagine. So it's you now it's going to be, <laughs> but there's too many options. All right, so now well, let's keep that. And then we have that, and then we'll get rid of this, and we'll get rid of that. But this, this is some residue crap, so it's connected there, so we have to um, delete it or disconnect it to this knife. Uh, I have to say that even though um, Illustrator has being really prob problematic lately. It is probably in the top 10 of top three of my favorite programs that really can do anything. Uh, it might even be number one. And that wasn't always the case. And it's a, 
it's a huge program. I mean, I'm not, I'm only using basic features. I mean, I use a lot of stuff, but you can really do so many advanced things with it. I'm even use layers in that. Uh, come on. Come on, just like, what? See, now it's acting, what the hell is going on? See, now it's not selecting. See, I don't know what the hell is going on. It's That's a new feature that it doesn't select things for you. It doesn't show you, all right? And now it's working now. Yay. Stupid illustrator. It's like a bad relationship. Okay, so that would be that. And then uh, let's make a... This is a lot of crap in there. See, I, see it doesn't select. See, you should, you should see the bounding box over it. And it doesn't do it for some reason. Oops. And uh, I don't know what to select, so that's the problem. It doesn't do it. Uh, anyway, uh, I just gotta, you gotta do, 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 do. Oh. And then there's some other things that are really messed up that Illustrator does these days, which I don't love. We don't get into. I don't know. I don't know what the problem is. Okay, so we have that. We have that. And what we're going to do is we're going to. Um, it didn't work. This, this, this. Group that. Okay. So now we're going to take this. I'm going to go into Photoshop and I'm going to switch over. And I'm going to flip it over in a second so you can see it. And what we're going to do is we're going to, um, I don't know how to do it. Uh, we're going to stop presenting and then we'll start presenting in Photoshop. And then we'll start presenting in. Photoshop, yeah, okay. Let's see if it works. Hello? Yes, cool, huh? All right. All right, now we have this, um, now we have the uh, zebra. And I'd love to check to make sure it's clean. Okay. And is that okay? Yeah. That's kind of weird. Let's see if we put a stroke on this just to see if there's any residual crap. And there is, yeah, stuff. Little things. And all we have to do is um, just. Uh, Get rid of it like that. Those are some like points. It just are some dots or something that brought it that was brought in. And then you know, I don't know if we'll keep the lines or not. Just this is temporary. I'll turn it off like that. Oh, there's you know, there's like crap underneath it. So yeah, see, there's this this stuff. We gotta fix that. They got rid of some of the uh, the white. So what we'll do is we will make a. We'll select this outside, and then underneath it, we will fill it in with white. And didn't do it so because it's doing the. Uh, why did it do that? Okay, so what we're going to do is, right, so select uh, this, yeah, so that's right, and then, right, no, you have to invert it, that's fine, invert it, and then we got full, huh, right up in there. Something is amiss. Go back to Illustrator. 
something happened when I brought it in. So let's try it again. See, so the lines are all messed up. Maybe I shifted it somehow. I don't know. So try it again. Huh. There it is again. It's weird. Oh, wait. It's a, it's a double. What is that? Well, that's weird. That is strange. Ugh, God. Maybe it's something. Hold on a second. Hmm. That is something weird with. Something weird with Illustrator. Okay. Something is up with that. I don't know what happened there. So here's what it's supposed to look like. And Illustrator is just, I don't know. All right, so I'm going in. Uh, I'm gonna try to fix it. Uh, Jesus Christ. Okay. All right, hold on. I'm in Illustrator now. I'm not gonna ship back. It's gonna like. See if I can fix it real quick. You can hear the sweet sounds of my voice as we're doing it. I'm just basically doing the same thing, just doing it again. And I'm gonna, what happened? Something in Illustrator is its technical term. Fucked up. Uh, let's see. So we're gonna clean it up a little. And I'll bring it in. Into okay, so now I'm gonna ignore white. I'm in Illustrator now, so you can't see it. You're still in Photoshop, and then we're gonna this reduce that. Okay, so I'm bringing it back. Here we go. That is wrong. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. And then, all right, see that's better. I don't know what the hell happened. Magic and wonder of computers. Right. So it still has the um, the this part is transparent. So what we'll to fix it? So we'll get rid of this. And, okay. So if we do the stripes again, you can see how it filled up the whole thing. All we we'll have to do is um, put some white underneath it. Okay, so we'll do the same thing again. So we will select this outside area, invert it, make a, then this, and there we go. So yeah, I don't know what that will happen. So now it's filled with wonderfulness. And now you have this area here, and then we'll just get rid of that. There we go. And then we'll collapse these two layers. Okay. And then we'll have this. There we go. And then we do it on this. So let's see what it's in black. Always check it on black. Up, see, it's got this crap on the side. I think it's from that white. But all you have to do is go to uh, matting and go to the fringe and go to 200. And it should get rid of it. There you go. Nice. All right. And do we want this? We want this part. Uh, okay, so let's do that. So we'll just do some blah, blah, blah. Let's fill this in over here, blah, blah, blah. And then blah, blah, blah. I'm just gonna put a white uh, outline of it. So it just, it will have something there, but I don't know, does that work? Does that work? Let's, um, this thing, get rid of some of this crap that we don't need. This, like that. and then if we put a outline on it, it's still white. Got this in the corner. All right, so then we got some crap there, and some crap there, and some crap there, and some crap there. So that's not bad. So, okay, so that's cool. And then let's get our type from the horrible illustrator. 
so that and then uh, I don't know what the hell is going on here. I really don't know what the hell is going to go in there. I love zebras, and I will not lie. I love zebras. Oops. Okay, so I'm gonna make this like that. Problem is, I was having with Photoshop was crashing. <laughs> It was crashing, so that's fun. All right, so okay, so um, let's uh, invert this and let's make this a lovely red. That's what all hearts are. And then let's put a big, shiny, uh, reflective thing on it because it's such a happy heart. And then we'll reduce the reflection. This it's just bursting with happiness. Then put it on a black t-shirt. And uh, what we can do maybe just for ha ha's, we'll just put a few slight shadows under the under his. Head. Let's put a black there. Oops, no, is that right? Put a black there. Use it. This. And, oops, oops. Uh, that. Reduce that to this. And the problem is that they have different commands. <laughs> All right. So okay. So. Ooh. Like this. Oops. Okay, let's see if that works or not. Eh, that's let's do the fifteen percent. Eh, doesn't really add anything. Okay, so that's that. Thanks for watching, and talk to you soon.